Hey guys, thanks for checking out another video with Paddleboard Georgia. Last February, we had the opportunity to take a group down to Silver Springs in Ocala, Florida. We joined a couple other paddleboarding groups, including Georgia Florida Paddleboarding out of North Florida and Otter Paddle out of Orlando. I'm thankful we had the opportunity to go with so many other paddleboarders and meet new people and grow as a community. The water at Silver Springs is absolutely incredible. It's so clear, you can see all kinds of wildlife down beneath. Everything from manatees to fish and turtles. And yes, there are definitely gators around, but if you don't mess with them, they really don't mess with you. Silver Springs is a perfect place to go, not only for experienced paddlers, but for new people. We even had a few first time paddleboarders in our group and it's a very wide area, doesn't have a whole lot of debris to navigate around. So it's a perfect location to, to bring someone who's new and who wants to learn, but might be intimidated by tight corners and uh, branches in the water, that kind of thing. Not only is Silver Springs perfect for paddlers of all skill levels, but it has some really neat things to see like monkeys. The monkeys were introduced into the area in the 1930s when they were filming Tarzan and they've been in the area ever since. Also, if you want to learn more about different areas of the springs, they have glass bottom boats you can take tours on like the one you see passing me here. They send out glass bottom tour boats throughout the day every day and those are great opportunities to learn about things like the Mammoth Springs where they found the skeleton of a woolly mammoth as well as some of the other smaller springs that help to feed this river. There's also a shipwreck and some statues, so I'm told. They offer those tours and then they have an extended tour that you do have to book in advance. I'd highly recommend taking one of these tours because there's a lot of things that we missed out on on the river that if we had gone on the tour first, we could have known about them and spent more time looking at these things on our paddleboards later in the day. Feel free to reach out to Paddleboard Georgia to find out when we're taking our next adventure to Silver Springs. We hope to see you guys on the water.